there's a scene on the road trip um, where Eli, it's, it, it's, it's, it flashes by in a second, but he's playing a Terminator 2 video oh, game. Right, yeah. And I, I don't think that was coincidental. Uh, I well, think there's a little bit of T2 that. influence. No, here. there absolutely is. Um, you know, there was a, a little bit of nostalgic 80s influence on this film, for sure. Mostly from a wish fulfillment for a child kind of perspective. I mean, there are a lot of the movies we grew up we, with. We, yeah. we loved films like Flight of the Navigator and, and uh, Last Starfighter and mm -hmm. E.T. You know, a lot of those mm -hmm. films are about a young kid that is, has found something that completely changes their life. Mm -hmm. And right. so this is the modern version of that. In right. We wanted mm -hmm. to do the 2018 version. Um, I know there's some, uh, it says Stranger Things on the poster. That was happening in tandem at the same time, so we actually didn't know anything about that. But there is similarity in the fact that there's a 80s kind of nostalgia that is on this film. Mm -hmm. But it's our version of a 2018 thing. And then these two guys down the bottom, we're calling them the, the cleaners. Yes. Uh, that, there is a tip of the hat to Terminator for sure. Absolutely. We also just played that video game when we were kids. So <laughs> we were like, if we can get it in a movie, yeah, why wouldn't yeah. we get was it? Was that your game? The, your that, game that you I'll, put I'll in tell you what. That, that and was, the one next to it, which was Joust, which we also uh, got permission to use, and we put them next to each other. Nice. Uh, Terminator 2 video game was the hardest license to get in the entire mm -hmm. film, mm -hmm. funny enough. That, yeah. that took a long time, yeah. but we got it. Yeah.